it out. Now, have you guys been hearing about these caves that Noor holds her little get-togethers in? And I'm using the word get-togethers very lightly. There's not chai being served here. There's some crazy shit going down. Now, I'm an open-minded guy. After all, I do host a free radio program to you guys, okay? Uh, is it me? Am I just a square? But I've never understood people who are into the weird stuff. I think sex is fun. I am very grateful for it. I do the deed. I say thank you. And I keep it moving. But if you are all about sticking your hard disk into some girl's floppy drive and then pulling out the nipple clamps and whips, that's just too far for me, okay? I, I bruise way too easy for that shit. I mean, remember one time, I was with this girl. She was into some crazy S&M shit. She was like, fuck me. But then she started punching me and she was like, fuck you. And I was like, oh my God, this is my Vietnam. What's happening here? I don't know what, how to make sense of this whole thing. Uh, look, I'm a basic guy. I'm a simple guy. I like vanilla ice cream and I like three positions, okay? Missionary, doggy style, and I'm sorry. That's pretty much what I do when I have sex. Oh, come on, Shorty. You don't say I'm sorry. into Radio Free Kirat. So as you guys know, Pagan is using the now defunct local tea distributor, Kaira Tea, as the center for Paul Deplore's opium business. <laughs> what? I wonder if that's fooling anyone in the law enforcement community abroad. I mean, Deplore is using the same trucks, the same farms, the same warehouses, and all that stuff still has the same old Kaira Tea logos. Thank you, Captain Obvious. I guess it doesn't matter out here. It's not like we have the same sort of anti-narcotics agencies here. There's no DEA like they have in the States. No NNCC like they have in China. And they don't even care that we know they're dealing drugs. Like that'd be one step too far after all the killing, torture, and forced labor. There isn't an advisor somewhere in Pagan's palace going, Hey, uh, Pagan, you know, the polls say that assassinations and fascism is okay, but, you know, the people of Kirat, they definitely draw the line at selling drugs. The last thing they want us to be is drug dealers. We'd lose our shot at the Nobel Peace Prize if they knew that we were moving those drugs. Then again, they did hand out one of those things to a guy who doles out drone strikes like they were going out of style. And yes, I I'm not going to be subtle. I'm talking about you, President Obama, okay? I, I, I was rooting for you this whole time, and then you guys just dish out drone strikes like crazy. And what are you going to do? Come after me? You guys could do that. You actually do have the power to do that. I mean, Falcon probably can find me, but you guys definitely can. Yeah. Don't just book by its cover. I actually respect Falcon because his cover is actually crazy, so you know the book you're getting into is going to be fucking nuts. <sighs> Let's get back to the music. Sure. Uh, play something upbeat.
Amita, everyone's dead here. Damn. Those were good soldiers that died. Tell me they didn't die in vain. Tell me you found the intel. It's a map of a temple or something. <sighs> okay, Ajay. This could be important. I'll check it out. And thank you. Thank you for following my lead. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> 